Hey everyone, it's me Nita, and welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm just gonna be packaging up some Etsy, or actually no, I'm gonna be packaging up some eBay orders, and then I also have two orders from my own website. So I'm cutting a bunch of fabric because they're all fabric orders. I do have two other Etsy orders, but it's for a baby blanket and a dog bandana. So I'm gonna save those for tomorrow because those don't have to go out yet. So today I'm just focusing on my fabric orders. Okay, so I have all my orders printed out already, and I also printed out the shipping labels too. Um, I don't think I was—I don't think I mentioned it yet, but I seriously, serious, I seriously need to get a Rollo printer or some type of thermal printer for labels because I'm tired of constantly having to print them out and cut them out. So I don't want to deal with that anymore. So I'm going to be looking into investing into a label printer one of these days I need to get around to looking at it I think they're around like a hundred or two hundred bucks um, I don't need to get a fancy one but it just seems like it'd be so much easier if I had my labels already printed out and all I had to do was just peel them and put them on the package so as you guys can see I have all my minky fabric my minky fabric doesn't come on bolts because I buy a wholesale from Alibaba. So it makes storage very difficult. So I'm thinking what I'm gonna do is, whenever I have time, I'm going to pre-cut a lot of the minky fabric so I can fold it and put it away nicely because I'm running out of space. I have like no room left in this room. I am going to wear a mask while I cut this fabric because there's a lot of lint in this room so I don't wanna be breathing any of that in so I have a mask so guys I've been actually staying consistently consistently busy um, one week will be mostly like baby blanket orders and then like the next week will be like a lot of t-shirt orders and then I'll get a bunch of fabric orders so each week I feel like has been different um, for me but luckily my husband's home today so I don't have to try and like cut fabric with my kids in here because it's impossible to try and do anything with my kids in here because they just get into everything.
Okay guys, so here are all of the fabric orders. Now I just need to package them up and then I need to rush over to the post office. I just ran out of all my cute teal poly mailers, so I only have these left. So I'm gonna use these today. And, and then I'm also gonna be using these clear bags. These are a nine by 12. And then I also have these little tiny ones, which I believe are a six by nine. Sorry for the noise. fabric put into the clear plastic bags. Now I'm going to go ahead and put these into the poly mailers. Alright guys, I have all my packages packaged up and ready to go to the post office. Alright guys, well thank you guys so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed this pack orders with me video. Uh, make sure to give this video a like if you'd like to see more of these and don't forget to sign up for my email list because I am giving away one free applique design for the month of, for the month of March. So make sure to go to my website, sign up for my email list and in a few days I'll be sending out a new applique design for you guys. Well, that is it. I need to jam over to the post office before they close. I will see you guys next time. Bye. Mm -hmm.